Hi, I'm Andrew, and it's nice to see you in another video on our NFT game channel. Today we're going to bring you 5 play to earn NFT games no investment that will blow your mind. If you like videos like this, be sure to leave a thumb up and we will record another video where we show you more NFT games that can make you a lot of money. Be sure to let us know in the comments what games you'd like to see in the next video, also subscribe to our channel to stay updated with all the news in the world of cryptocurrencies and NFT games. Here are some of the best NFT games that you can try. Let's get started. Number 5. Castle Crush. Castle Crush is a multiplayer game in which you battle 1v1 on a small map consisting of three lanes. You will need to summon soldiers and fantastic monsters to overcome one lane in order to reach the opponent's castle and destroy it. The gameplay of Castle Crush is all about strategy and fast-paced matches. When you first start the game you're thrown into a tutorial that does a good job of explaining the basics. Similar to Clash Royale, the game is played by dragging cards, representing soldiers or spells, from your deck onto one of three lanes that lead straight to the enemy castle. The armies that you summon will move automatically and battle anyone they encounter along the way. Each card costs a varying amount of crystals. Crystals recharge slowly, and the maximum amount of crystals you can have is 12 per match, and what you spend it on is up to you. For instance, you could summon an epic monster costing 10 crystals or many low-cost minions to try and rush the enemy if they are not prepared. The crystals recharge slowly, so if you spend it all too fast and the opponent has a counter to your play, you will be left defenseless and unable to use your cards until the crystals accumulate again. The game boasts a surprisingly large number of strategies, and you won't find yourself getting bored anytime soon. Every creature summon has a unique function, and how you use them is important. There aren't any dominating or overpowered strategies in the game and everything has an appropriate counter. Put another way, every option is useful and can be played optimally in its own style. Number 4. The Harvest. The Harvest is a fresh new take on class-based hero shooters. Fight along with your teammates from different civilizations against other players to take control of the universe's essence. Define your combat style as you play, gaining and combining different abilities to become the last squad standing. Discover this new sci-fi universe and get ready, the harvest has begun. The harvest goes beyond the common class systems in the shooter genre thanks to the dynamic class-based system. Choose your breacher, select your base setup and build your full potential during combat in a flexible ability system. During the harvest teamwork is rewarded, so all your teammates will benefit from the resources you get. Control the key zones of the map to gather enough resources and upgrade your breacher. To survive the harvest you will have to team up with your mates and build the best strategy, but if things get messy, you can always use the respawner to revive the fallen. Origin is an uninhabited planet that contains the remains of an ancient civilization that controlled the most precious substance in all of creation, the essence. The planet is a zealous protector of the essence, but it opens itself at undetermined intervals and for an undetermined time span. The Harvest is a new IP created from scratch with deep lore. It has different civilizations, heroes, conflicts, risk-taking and, maybe, chivalric romance in its background. Discover all the stories about each creature, their civilizations, and their motivations to risk their lives in the Harvest. Number 3. Dragon SB. Dragon SB is the first metaverse MMORPG game built on the Terra Protocol. The game is based on a wildly popular platform, the Binance Smart Chain. With Dragon SB, players control warrior dragons. In the game, players engage in thrilling battles and discover an entirely new environment the world of dragons. In this world, the player engages in fierce battles, kills vicious beasts with bestowed superpowers, and earns SB and NFTs. Additionally, the player can transfer in-game NFTs tout game NFTs. This transfer makes trading, staking, and farming for SB possible. These actions promote an increase in earnings. With the combination of NFT and DeFi, users can accumulate earnings while entertaining themselves. Dragon SB was built with the Unreal Engine. This means that players will enjoy 3D visuals, state-of-the-art interactive effects with high visual quality and smooth motion, 
all combined with artificial intelligence AI, to control the actions of the Dragon character in the game. Dragon SB connects millions of players from around the globe. It is equipped with a diverse ecosystem and provides the opportunity to play for money. Number 2. Crypto Ball Z. Crypto Ball Z on Wemix is a P2E mobile shooting game fused with idle RPG elements where the characters from Game of Dice, a game loved by 50 million fans around the world, will fight alongside players. The game's idle RPG aspects allow the gameplay to be fun and easy for players of all kinds. Crypto Ball Z on Wemix introduces a remarkable mining system, which is the core element of P2E games, in the form of drone searches, adding an easily accessible and convenient element to the gameplay. Through the drone search, players can earn hero stones which can be used for various in-game purposes, such as upgrading heroes, or these hero stones can be exchanged for the utility token, Herco. Mojito Games is also planning on releasing fantastic NFT commanders which can provide various buffs that increase mining efficiency, the chance of obtaining top-tier heroes and more. A massive airdrop event is also being planned where a total of 5 million Herco will be given away. The event will take place in three different phases during the pre-registration period and last until the actual launch of the game. Number 1. Legend of Pandonia. Legend of Pandonia is a role-playing game developed by Pando Software for Google Android and Apple iOS devices. You will be gathering a group of heroes together and leading them through battle to save the continent of Hermes. As you gain strength, you will get powerful gear and abilities that will help you on your quest. Once you've conquered the monsters of the game, see if your team is strong enough to take on other players in PvP battles. That would be it for today's episode. Once again, I remind you to leave a thumb up below this video, in the comment write about what next project we should mention. Thanks so much for watching this video and see you in the next one, bye.